Today, we take a peek into my protective audio toolbox. Hey, sound guys and girls. I'm Jimmy Hepworth, your Saturday sound guy. Pelican cases are often the go-to solution for lugging our audio gear, but they come at a serious price. So today I'm gonna to show you this, my audio toolkit. It has some serious advantages over Pelican at a fraction of the cost. Let's take a look. What we got here is a basic DeWalt toolbox. Let's open it up and see what we've got inside. You'll notice first is my Zoom F4 recorder. Fits perfectly into this little spot right there, nice and snug. There's also room for my Rode NTG3 in its shockproof case, as well as a transmitter and receiver for my Rode Link system. The foam here is made for this particular toolbox, which is quite nice. It fits in there perfectly. So let's close that up. The top here really is my favorite part. As you can see, there's so many places to put all those little things that you really need to have with you when you're on set or on location. Here we've got my lavalier microphone in its nice protective pouch, as well as some other adapters for my Roadlink system. spot for everything. There's plenty of places to put things like batteries, which I put right here, as well as this, my battery pack for my Zoom F4 recorder. You can keep the batteries in it and it fits perfectly into that little spot as though it were made for it. Got a place for my SD cards, a mic clip, some chargers. Here I have a couple of adapters, XLR to TRS adapter for my Zoom F4, just in case. I also have these little rubber bands for my Rode blimp, in case one breaks, as well as a tool for my Rode blimp just to keep things nice and tight. Here I've got a couple of utensils with some gaff tape on them. I've got this Sharpie with white gaff and a pencil with black gaff. This is just enough gaff tape to help you mic up the talent, do the things you need, but without the video department hounding you for your expensive gaff tape. With all these things in the top compartment, it can tend to get a little top heavy when it's open, but that's really the only downside. Here's a place to put a padlock, lock it up, as well as this briefcase style handle. Most of the time though, I like to use this top handle here. It keeps everything nice and level, and I'll just yeah take it with me. I got the toolbox and the foam for less than $35, though the price seems to fluctuate a little bit on Amazon, so I'll leave links in the description below. So what's the verdict? I actually love this case. It gives me everything that I want and need. It has a low cost, but without sacrificing that professional look that Pelican cases can give. And it also gives me a place to put everything securely. It's not going to be quite as secure as, say, a Pelican case, maybe not quite as shockproof or waterproof but it's going to do the job for me. The foam is really easy to pick and place, but I would take some time to consider the shape that you want before you go and shape your foam. That being said, the foam is rather inexpensive, so if you do make a mistake or you want to use this toolbox for something different down the line, it's really easy to just go and pick up another piece of foam. If you think I've earned it, go ahead and like and subscribe, and until next time, I'm Jimmy Hepworth, your Saturday Sound Guy. Thanks for watching. If you have a sound effect you'd like me to try, go ahead and leave me a note in the comments section down below.